Hey, I'm Ron Drodos from KeyboardImprov.com and welcome to my journey through the real book. I'm going through every real book tune in order and I'm up to number 24 this week, Autumn in New York. Welcome if you've just started watching this series or if you've been joining me from the beginning. Um, welcome back. It's a real pleasure to share this with you and hopefully it inspires you to do the same thing. Check out this great collection of tunes. Um, Autumn in New York is one of those old uh, great ballads. And I, um, I know a lot of people have done it. Pianists, uh, Billie Holiday sang it, but I tend to think of it as one of these like tenor saxophone songs where they're just phrasing it like a vocalist and freely embellishing it. And I tend to stay pretty close to the melody on this. I think it's just so gorgeous. Um, you know, and I really don't know what's going to happen with this, this version right here. I might go totally away from the melody, having said that. But, um, but I, I tend to stay with the melody and embellish it. Similar to um, uh, what some of the great pianists like Art Tatum might have done. Um, not that I, I'm not trying to play like Art Tatum, but I probably can't. But, um, but to stay with the melody and embellish it like a theme in variations kind of thing. I think it's, it's kind of a lost art. It's beautiful when you can do that on these old ballads. Charlie Parker, another great um, uh, interpreter of ballads. So um, enjoy this, Autumn in New York. <laughs> Thank you. 
fun tune to play. I hope you know it or are, are, are going to work on it. Um, and it's funny because um, I never do two-handed runs where I start with one hand and do another one. But since maybe since I mentioned Art Tatum uh, before I started playing, I kind of thought of him and, and uh, at least tried to do one. So uh, enjoy. Um, go through the real book. Make this part of your uh, daily routine at some point. Just learn these tunes. It's important to memorize tunes. I have this basically memorized, but I looked at it a couple times just to make sure. I, I don't always play this tune. Um, but it's really beautiful, as I hope you just heard. And uh, if you're looking for uh, jazz piano instruction, check me out at keyboardimprov.com. I've got over 300 videos, and uh, we'll give you personalized instruction. Anything you need to help you play better, that's what I want to do for you. So uh, thank you, and I'll see you in the next video.